Hey guys, so I'm here to do a Gatlinburg haul. We went on a weekend trip a few weeks back to Gatlinburg. This this haul is a little overdue and I might have forgotten some stuff. I was really sick um, last week and I'm still not feeling 100% but I wanted to get this video done sooner than later. Um, so we went to Gatlinburg a couple weeks ago and we got a lot more than I expected to. I mean, like I said, I probably forgot some stuff and then some stuff's really not that big of a deal. Um, and then some stuff I just don't have anymore because it was food items and obviously we ate them. So we're going to start off with um, some food items that... I technically still have, but don't really, I don't know. So the first ones, um, we went to this um, jerky shop and they also had peanuts. And we got um, regular honey roasted peanuts and then we also got these. This will focus, probably won't, but it's um, sea salted caramel peanuts and they're really good. Um, I still have some left, not a lot, um, but we got those. Um, and then uh, right below the jerky shop was a candy store we did go to and we, it had like old fashioned candies and also had a lot of candies you can still buy today. Um, but we had gotten some candy, none of that's around anymore. Um, I don't even know how it disappeared so fast, but it did. <laughs> um, I also, we went to a popcorn store and I got a bucket of caramel corn and it's basically gone. Um, I had a, a lot of help eating this, so don't think I ate all this by myself. So I'm going to set some of this stuff on the floor and hope that the dog doesn't think it's his. Because he seems to think that anything on the floor is his. No. Alright, so moving on. Um, we went to this cute little store in Gatlinburg. Um, it kind of reminded me of, I don't know if you guys have ever been to um, Myrtle Beach, but there's a store there. I don't know if it's still there or not. I haven't been in a few years, but it's called the Gay Dolphin. And it's basically what I would call a junk store where it's just got a variety of things. Anyway, we went to this cute little shop or junk store and um, we had bought Justin's mom four pandas that they had there, which obviously I can't show you because she took them back with her to Florida. And I also got a new penguin for my collection. Um, I thought this was really cute because it looks like they're actually kissing, so um, that will go on the penguin shelf. And so that's all I got from that store. Um, so the next day we went to Pigeon Forge. First we went to what they call the Island, which is an outdoor strip mall area. and. Um, I got, actually we went to the Christmas store the day before, but I want to do the Christmas store last, so we'll backtrack to that. Anyway, um, so I got some little things for my niece and nephew, so if they watch this, they're going to know they get it. This is a little truck that has Jonathan's name on it, and um, it says it on both sides, so I got him that. And then I got my niece a keychain because she is of that age. But it's got her, oops, you can't really see it. Yeah, it's got her name on it. And it's got like three little, I'm going to guess they're fake diamonds, but little diamonds right here. And it's, it's really pretty. Um, I was going to get her a necklace, but honestly, I don't think think she would wear a necklace because uh, she's a marching band so she's yeah anyway so I got her that keychain and then I got Jonathan a truck um, 
I haven't decided if they're going to be Christmas gifts, birthday gifts, or what. So they got those. Like I said, if they watch this, they know they're going to get it. This is not a we went to the Old Smoky, which is a moonshine place. Justin got some cherries. Um, we gave some of these to his mom, so no, Justin has not eaten all of these. But we got some cherries. They are, um, this is their chocolate cherries. So they're cherries soaked in chocolate moonshine. And um, I don't like cherries really, so I don't know what they taste like, so I can't tell you. And then he also got this blackberry moonshine. This is really good. I've tasted it so good um, I made him give me a shot of it the other day my throat was hurting and it helped a lot but this is super good moonshine and then he's got this which we have not opened um, I haven't tasted it. it is called mountain Java and it's a creamy moonshine that they say um, you could put in your coffee and stuff you could use it as a ice cream topper which is really liquidy so I don't really see that I could maybe see making like a milkshake with it or something there's what it looks like because um, they put the thing on there so you can't really tell what it looks like but yeah I mean it looks like um, it, honestly it looks like light chocolate milk that's the best way I can describe it. So, moving on. Um, also, while we were there at the island, we went to a wine place. Um, I do not normally like wine. I went in here to this place and I told the guy I don't like wine. He's like, well, what wines have you tried? And I was like, well, I've tried this white wine. I've tried this one purpley wine. Basically, I told him about the wines I tried and he's like well it sounds like you don't like grape wine so try these berry wines and so he gave us like a whole taste test of different berry wines and there were two that I actually liked so the first one which I bought three bottles of is the strawberry wine it's not gonna focus of course because it's too I need to get blackout curtains for my room but anyway this is strawberry wine and I bought three bottles of this super good and then we also got um, we also had bought two bottles of the blackberry wine we gave one to Justin's mom and then I kept one and then we also got um, something Blush, I think it was called I don't remember but we bought that for Justin's mom because she liked it um, and so those were the wines we got and uh, let's see I feel like I'm forgetting something do we buy any oh I did go we went to the ball Paula Dean for lunch and I bought me a cup which I want to go grab so this cup is actually dirty because I need to wash it but it says blush Bless your heart, I bought it for work. It has a lid that goes with it, but like I said, it's dirty so I had to go pull it out of the sink to show you guys. But yeah, I got that from the Paula Deen store. They had an apron that I really wanted that said bless your heart. And Justin and I are planning on going back in like December because I wanna to go to Titanic at Christmas. And so I will probably get that apron while I'm there in December if they still have it. We went to a store called Christmas More. I found the cutest, cutest Halloween tree. And, but, and it lights up. It actually lights up. So I'm gonna hang some cute little Halloween ornaments on it probably. Um, and honestly, it's been sitting in the living room ever since I bought it. It kind of just fits there. I mean, it is what it is, right? So anyway, that's all we bought at the island. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure. 
Anyway, we went off to the outlet mall. First store we went to is Tord. Um, and I got this cute sweater. And yes, I'm wearing a sweater in July because it's 70 degrees here, which doesn't seem like it's cold, that cold, but it's kind of chilly. Anyway, and then I also, I was kind of sad they didn't have the big one because the store here in Indiana, I, last time I went, had the big one, but I got my favorite perfume, which is Toward Bloom. You guys can't see it because it's like normal. Too much light. I need I need blackout curtains so bad. Anyway, it's called Toward Bloom and it smells so good. I love this perfume so much. Anyway. And so we went to Toward um and then we went to another moonshine place, which I'm gonna save that before I go to the Christmas store because when we were at the outlets, we also went to Skechers and they had buy one get one half off. And so Justin's mom bought a pair of shoes and she got me these, which are some Skecher bobs. Yes, these are bobs. I don't know if you can see them, bobs, but I've been wearing them. They are so, so comfortable, so comfortable. Um, and she also made some socks there as well. So those are actually in my bedroom and I'm not going to go get them so you, cause you don't need to see my socks. Anyway, um, so then we went, like I said, before we went to the Skechers store and after the tour store, we went to a place called Smith Creek Moonshine and I did a tasting there and oh my God. It was great. Um, I never knew that I would like moonshine. I'm just gonna throw that out there. There were some I didn't like. Like there was a chocolate one that I thought was disgusting, and then there was a um, coffee one that I thought was disgusting, and there were a few that I was like, eh, they're okay. But we did get the ones that I liked. We bought four. But we gave one to his mom. Um, we gave her the salted caramel because that was her favorite. So that's the one she got. And then we also bought lemon lime, which they liked. To, they said that they call it um, margarita in a bottle or something like that. Margarita in a jar. Um, he said this one is really good to mix with like Sprite and stuff but it was really good. So we got that one. We also got um, apple pie, which was really, really good. Like you can taste the Macintosh. It tastes like Macintosh apples and cinnamon. So delicious. Oh my God. This place, um, I'm not gonna lie, I thought was a lot better, like, um, I'm trying to think of the right word. I thought it was better than the Old Smokies was because they were more one-on-one -on -one with you so you, you felt like they really cared about your experience whereas Old Smoky is more touristy now so you don't get as much one-on-one -on -one there. Anyway, and then my favorite was the cinnamon and oh my god, have you guys ever had Hot Damn? This is like so much better than hot damn, but almost similar. Oh my God, cinnamon is amazing, amazing. I'm going to make some hot chocolate this Christmas for the adults and it's gonna have some hot damn in it and it's gonna be so good. Oh my God, I love this stuff. And I, that's what we got at the Moonshine Place. And so let's move on.